They say you never know what you have until you lose it. And I just realized that because it's been a while now and we have not been shooting for the Crystal Beauty Show because of some technical issues, but we are back now and we are here for business. It is another beautiful day and you're welcome to another bright episode. My name is Tiafak M. Tonka and you know how we do it here now, you know lots of fun games and you know happiness 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 so today i'm in the studio with this awesome young talented handsome let me say handsome then i say hide your girls <laughs> and awesome guitarist in the name of wait i'll not tell you his name we'll just go and find out good afternoon mr percy oh thank you very much uh, mr tiafak and it's a pleasure to be here on crystal beauty show I heard about the show and he's doing a good work and it's a pleasure to be here and thank you for the great introduction. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> it's my job, it's my job and I'm, I'm an MC, so you know, I'm supposed to act like you a little bit. Yeah. Now, Mr. Press, how are you doing today? I'm doing fine, excellent, as you can see, and we're out here, it's a, it's a cold weather, everywhere is just cool and it's, it's, I think it's a, it's, a, it's a good energy in the studio. Okay, that's nice. <laughs> See, the Crystal Beauty Show has good energy. So please, you should be dying to come here. As a matter of fact, if you want to visit, just, you know, you know what to do. Stay in the comment section. Okay, Mr. Priest, we're going to dive in the right of knowing who Percy is. So that's where our first question is going to be erupting from. Yes. Who is Percy Abain? I, I think I'm getting it correct. You, you got it. Well. Okay, beautiful. So who is Percy Abain? Per Percy Abain, like some will call Abain, some call okay. it Abain, it doesn't matter. Okay. Percy Abain is a dreamer. Oh. And it's a very confident person and at the same time, very humble. Okay. Percy Abain uses uh, music, which is his, um, his talent, mm -hmm. to, to preach love, preach peace in whatever means or whatever opportunity he has. Okay. Yes, and, and that's it. He has bigger dreams to take the music further, okay. to inspire more people in the world and spread peace and love. That is really, really beautiful. We have ourselves a Bob Marley in the making. Eh? So mm -hmm. just in case you don't know, <laughs> I, I think you should start, uh, you know, doing your own dreadlocks. <laughs> no, they say we don't need to do that always. Real, real dreads are in the heart. Oh, you know? Okay, real dreads are in the heart. That's yes. very interesting. Yes. So, Percy, how long have you been into music? Yeah, I, I would say... Scenes from my mother's home. Okay. Because ever since I've been growing, I mean, a lot of people have noted me for being a good singer. But I didn't know that until when I was forced by a teacher, a secondary school teacher, mm -hmm. to, to be part of the school choir. Okay. And that's where I found myself. And I was, I was like, I was the main singer at the end of the day. And that's when I, I started developing the belief system. Um, this could actually make a difference, for, especially from the good comments and appreciations I got from people. Okay. So for this reason, sometimes I, I, I always appreciate those who support our dreams, okay. support whatever we are doing, because they have a great role to play to us and especially me. Okay, that's really beautiful. So how did it feel for you? Because I understand growing up as uh, children, we don't really like it when our parents, uh, or, or rather an elderly person tells us what to do. You know, it's usually, uh, you know, this, uh, okay, go and sing uh, But now you're making us understand that um, uh, it was a teacher that made you to realize your love for music. How was it? Were you not reluctant? I was, uh, indeed I was, because I always, I always love drawing. Oh, <laughs> I'm painting so... By that time in school, they were creating clubs. So we had a drawing club, okay. singing club, dancing club. Okay. So I wanted to go for drawing. Mm -hmm. And I went in, actually we started. So the teacher just came in, hey, Percy, go out, <laughs> join the choir. <laughs> I was like, what? Well, I didn't like it, but as, as a student, okay. I respected my teachers. Okay. While I was in secondary school, I was not stubborn. Okay. Yeah, I respected my Please teachers. Please don't be stubborn there. Eh? So I, I went there and at the end of the day, I mean, it, it, it made me a better person because I, I created a lot of impact in school yeah. as a good singer. I was noted for being a very good singer in the choir and lots of time, I took that opportunity to spend time teaching children. Okay. Maybe um, the, the junior students. Okay. I teach That's... them how to write songs. Probably I'll write some songs and I'll teach them how to sing it and they loved it. So during their free time, they'll come to me, Senior Percy, Senior okay. Percy. <laughs> Want to sing all of that? So, <laughs> okay. Uh, a, a lecturer of mine once told me that many are the teachers who can teach you, 
but few are the teachers who actually inspire you. Mm -hmm. So I would like you to tell us the name of this teacher that inspired you to do this. <laughs> so that, that means maybe there are some students in the school where he is now and we don't even know the potential of what he can do for them. Okay, he's a teacher. Um, I would say my uncle who was a teacher. Okay, yeah, he was a teacher. Yeah, okay. Principal, Uncle Vega Martin. Okay, that's that's. Yeah, nice. he knew me then because I was in the house and we were living together. Okay. So always in the house, I, I always sing. Okay. When I'm doing whatever the house choice, okay. I'm, I'm singing, okay. all of that. So okay. I don't know if he was listening. Okay. So it happened. He just had to. And sometimes we, we pray. We always pray. So sometimes we're praying. I will leave us singing, all of that. That's beautiful. So he got to that time. He's the one who told me, go there. So I didn't just respect him as a teacher. I respected him more as, as, as an parent, uncle. Yes. Yes. Okay. And, and as my, 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 my father. Okay. And, and that was it. Okay. It didn't end there, so I went there. A lot of teachers too, they, they, they enjoyed me and it was a great motivation. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's very beautiful. You just opened up uh, another chapter of your life. You said you write music. You know, a lot of artists have say, I'm a musician, I'm a singer, I'm a singer. Very yeah. few people say, I'm a singer, yeah. songwriter, yeah. because I know songwriting can really be a hell of a trouble. So tell us about that part of your life. So do you write all your songs or, you know, you tend to sing some songs of some other people? He, yeah, I, I write. Uh, if you mean sing some 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 songs of other people, as in, like, you are a recording artist, right? Yes. Okay. All the songs you have recorded, is it originally? Is it an original song, or you had to sing some songs that are wrote uh, that have been written by people? Okay, I I write songs. Okay. I write my songs, but in writing my songs, I might be writing it, but I get to 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 learn from a lot of people. Okay. There are people who don't directly contribute in my writing, but mm -hmm. sometimes from the speeches they make. From the things they tell me, the advices, okay. you know, it helps to inspire me. Like what we are doing here, it could inspire me to write a song. So I don't just want to take the glory alone. Okay. Yeah, what the teacher teaches me in school, okay. the motivational sp speaker speaking out there, the, the, the grandmother who goes to farm okay. and the, 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 the girl who is pregnant, okay. all of that. Is yes. So yeah. everybody has a story yeah. which contributes when I have to write down a song. Okay. And I have the way I write songs. If I'm writing each, each song, I take it as a project. Mm -hmm. there, there, should be, there should be a reason why am I writing this song and to whom am I writing it to and what kind of impact do I want to create? I always have those things in mind. Okay. Like, I picture it. I expect there are people, there are some songs I write, I know when, once this person listens to this kind of person in this situation, this level, the person will connect. Okay. So that's how I write my songs. That's, that's beautiful. That's and really awesome. What helps me too? I listen to a lot of songs, okay. a lot of music, and probably I learn to sing them too. So it guides me too. So what is your inspiration behind writing music as in? What do you need to do in order to come up with a beautiful piece? Yeah, sometimes when I want to write a song, mm -hmm. I could have a concept. Mm -hmm. And I don't actually have the melody that moment. Okay. But I just, I just have it in mind. I keep meditating on it. And all of a sudden, mm -hmm. it will come. Or sometimes I just get my guitar and I get it, I get a line, the, the, the progression and okay. with the concept, I start putting in words. I start putting in, because first of all, I have a good sense of melodies. Once I get a melody, I can easily start putting those words and making it musical, not just putting words. Yeah, yeah, I get the point. Yeah, yeah. Making it musical too. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much, Mr. <laughs> Percy Abain. And we are coming to the first, to end of the first half of the Crystal Beauty Show. It has really been awesome here. I've been inspired by myself. And we're going to take a break. Please don't go anywhere. Don't touch that button. Don't leave that YouTube page. We'll be right back. Oh, oh my God. It has really been inspirational. This first half, this young man we have here is really, 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 really amazing. That is, he's so, so inspiring. Now we are back for the second half of the Crystal Beauty Show. I'm sure you did not go anywhere. And if you haven't, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button below and click that notification bell so that you'll be the first person to know when we have a new episode. Now we're going to go back to Mr. Percy. Mm -hmm. This is my favorite part of the show. Okay. Do you know why? No. I'm sure you don't know why that's why you're still smiling. <laughs> because if you actually knew why, you would not be smiling. Oh. Now, we are going to play a little game. Yeah, I love that. Okay, love you love games. games. Yeah. Okay, that's nice. <laughs> okay, I can see, okay, I, you, can, you can see in front of you there is a cup. Yes. Now, in this cup, there are questions. Mm -hmm. Now, I will pick up the cup, stir it around, you know, mix up the questions a little <laughs> bit, then you will pick. 
Okay. Now, you will read the question so that the audience can hear you, mm -hmm. and then you answer as honestly as you can. If it's too difficult, just say pass and you know we'll move on. All right. But I, I will not like you to say pass. As a matter of fact, <laughs> my viewers do not like it when you say pass. I'll be honest. Though. If I okay. to say, I'll say it, but please understand. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. First, we are, uh, okay. We're going to pick um, three questions. Okay. I pick three. Pieces. No. You, yes. You first of all, you know, okay. one at a time. Let's okay. come down. It's a ladder we are climbing. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, the first question. Close my eyes. Yeah. We don't want my eyes. Ah. Okay. I read it. Yes, you're reading it aloud to the hearing of the audience and yes. All Ooh. right. Uh-huh. Favorite clothes. Okay, your favorite clothes. Okay. Favorite clothes. I like every good dress. <laughs> every good dress. <laughs> so you want to tell me do you know Kofi uh oh, let me do you. I know him. How oh, beautiful. <laughs> I like the way he dresses. It's unique. So you have to tell me that you wear that. Of course. No, it depends. He dresses in, in a lot of ways, you understand. That's why I say I like good dressing. There are times you just put on your gym t-shirt like me and the cap. I love that. Okay. Okay. What is your own dress code for you? My dress code? No, I don't, I'm not so like into a particular dress code. Okay. I'm so focused on I know looking good is good business. Okay. Look good, feel good. Okay. So like, I like this affect you, what you're putting on. Okay. And sometimes I look that way too. Sometimes I'm, I just- I'm not yeah. First he likes my dress. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sometimes I just want to look normal t-shirt. Okay. It is, you know, just cool. Look, like good, really look good, feel good. <laughs> look good, feel good. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go to the next question. I'm going to mix again and- uh, Okay. Don't you can free yourself of the first one then. Just right. put it on top of the chair. Yes. Hallelujah. Okay. Your best body parts of... <laughs> let, let me help you with that. If you, if you cannot read well, let me help you with that. All right, go ahead. Okay. Your best body part of the opposite sex. That is a very, very tough question. I like the crystal cup because it always starts gentle. Wow. Easy questions <laughs> you can answer. <laughs> of, the, of the opposite yes. um, sex. Man, I like. <laughs> uh, all right, um, I like the lips. <laughs> so don't get me wrong. I respect. I respect you all. Like I like. Yeah, I like the lips. Smile well. And, yeah, yeah. yeah he likes the lips. Yeah. He smile well. I like the lips. <laughs> I like the way he said it. He's kind of like. Well, okay. I like. Uh, I don't know this. <laughs> okay, I believe we don't want to, you know, interrogate that and go further into the question. But it's okay, you know, we, we keep that private sometimes because okay. we respect those around us. Okay. Okay, <laughs> okay Mr. Percy, we're going okay. to take the last and uh, the final question. You know, okay. your papa's been, you know, fairly nice to you. I don't like it. I yeah, like it when it's really dangerous. Yeah, these questions, you know. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> so I'm going to mix it up a little bit and you take your last question. Okay. Okay, beautiful. Okay. okay. Worst mistake. Okay, that's 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 nice. I would love to hear that. Worst oh. mistake. Worst mistake. Oh, first of all, I love this, but I, I can't remember because first I always learn to, to let go of the past. Okay. I easily I easily let go of anything that I mean doesn't align or didn't work well as mm -hmm. I wanted. Though it's normal. Not everything is favorable. Okay. Yeah, I believe I had those mistakes, but I already dealt with them. So they are gone and the future is very bright. Okay. So that's why. <laughs> okay, that's really beautiful. So he, he, I like his positivity, you know. He, he does not have time for negativity. He leaves the past in the past and look forward in the future. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Percy, for playing our uh, game ah. with us. And I'm sure it has really been exciting for you. Yeah, oh, man. <laughs> I've been laughing ever since. And I'm sure you uh, viewers out there are having a lot of fun. Now we are going to, uh, you know, dive slow a little bit and go a little bit intense okay now um person who is your inspiration as in who is that musician that i want to be like that person okay first uh, i'll give credits to to bob Marley. oh yeah in as much as there are, there are a lot of artists who really inspire me okay yeah i'm that kind of person i don't I don't give. Uh, I don't. I don't focus on a particular kind of music. Um, first, I focus on good music. Okay. So, I don't say I don't. I want to be like somebody. Okay. But I want to. I want to learn something from every artist. Okay. It doesn't matter big or small, whatever genre you're doing. I just feel like I can learn something from you. And 
add up to what I have and bring out something which is very unique, which no one has ever done. So that's what I always do. And that's why I listen to everybody. I give credits to Felakuti, okay. Manu Zibangos, or Makosa Legends here in Cameroon. The musicians in Nigeria, those who existed, Ray Charles, <laughs> All of them, you can name them. Okay. Richie, Michael Bolton, all of them. Okay, that's really nice. Yeah, so I just learned from them because they have been good and they did a good work. And I believe every part of them which I listen to could also inspire me to, to be the best of myself. Okay, that yes. is really, really nice. Um, uh, viewers, if you can remember when we were starting the show, I made mention of the fact that he's not only a singer, he's not only a songwriter, but he's an awesome guitarist. And uh, we're going to allow him to feel free with the guitar, you know, for 30 mm -hmm. seconds and, you know, <laughs> let him see what he can. So um, uh, let's just have 30 seconds of entertainment. So, All right. Yeah, Before sure. doing that, um, I'll, I'll be launching a song, a song of mine. Um, okay. Yes, yeah, soon. So I'll just give a little piece of it. Okay, so yeah. he's given us an exclusive. So just keep your ears open. Yeah, I, I wrote this song intentionally for, for the country regarding what is going on. Okay. Yeah, the, the, the crisis, the phone, whatever yeah, this, this yeah. year, so. Okay, let's hear it. Tell me now how far we've come from yesterday. It's a common say, come and block, me aujourd'hui, nous voyons les flammes. We all can see the flames, yet we cannot tell where this is leading us to. We lost our brothers in the military. We lost our fathers who are civilians. We've lost the children who are French speaking. We lost our children who are English speaking. People go in in hatred. People go in in bitterness. Yet we can't reveal who the real enemy is. Maybe I end it there, so... Oh, wow, 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 wow. <laughs> you cannot give them everything. If you give them everything That's here, weird, they are not going to go and listen. Ah, this is something you should be rushing for. Eh? So That's when is the release weird. date of this yeah. marvelous piece? I and my team, we are working on it. Um, okay. Just just follow me up on my, my Facebook page so that you can get the updates. Okay. So it will soon be available. And your, your support is really appreciated. Without you guys... I will not be what I am, and we will not do better. So every day we keep getting better, and your support matters a lot. Thank That's, you so much. That's really, really beautiful. So we are gradually landing this plane now, this exciting, fun field, and jam-packed with a lot of entertainment and education. And you know, like we always do it on the Crystal Beauty Show, you yeah. pick a pen and a paper, and you jot down words of inspiration. Now, Percy, mm -hmm. I am out there, or a young person is out there who is inspired by maybe your music and everything. What do you have to say to them? All I have to tell them is to stay focused okay. and let, let them not be pressured. Because I know a lot of artists out there, they, they, they just get pressured or excited when they see other people, other stars on TV. Mm -hmm. And let them take time, develop themselves and have a good connection with God. And try as much as possible to make themselves excellent and keep pleasing themselves and doing what they are doing without stopping. Okay. That is really, really beautiful. So I hope you were jotting down words of inspiration because it is really, really amazing. I mean, this guy is filled with lots and lots of wisdom and oh. we should not take advantage of that. <laughs> so if you, we, where can we find Percy? Is it only on Facebook? Where can oh. we find Percy? Um, I'm on Facebook. I'm on um, Instagram as Percy Abain. Okay. Percy Abain Instagram, Percy Abain Facebook. And Facebook page, Percy Official. Okay. And that's... also on YouTube, Percy Abain. Percy Abin, okay. Thank you so much, Mr. Abin Percy, for honoring our invitation to the Crystal Beauty Show. You don't know how thrilled we are. It's been a pleasure. Okay, it's thank you very much. Now, uh, listeners, rather viewers, this is the part of the show where I don't like, the part where we get to leave you to come back again another time. Well, it has really been awesome. I found myself laughing. I'm sure you've too. <laughs> and also, I'm sure you've been jotting down some words of inspiration because Mr. Percy has just been wise. 
I, 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 oh, I'm serious. He has, I been, he has, he has been really wise. <laughs> Thank you. <man>. And, <laughs> and it has been really, really fun. Not to forget that this um, episode of the Crystal Beauty Show was brought to you by Solace Home Care Agency. They are simply the best in the business. They are based in Frisco, Texas, and they are specialized in taking care of uh, sick ones and old people at home. So you can go, you know, rush to the market, rush to um, uh, the work, your workplace, do your one or two things. So if you need them, you can go to their Facebook page and uh, leave them a message there at um, uh, Solis Home Health Care Agency. Or maybe you can just dive to their website at www.solishha, that is all in uh, lower cases, dot com. Solis H H A lowercases.com uh, don't forget you've been watching the crystal beauty show and you've just been so so beautiful at the other side of the camera if you want to get to us you can get to us on the crystal beauty show at um, facebook instagram youtube and what have you just don't forget okay now i have been chef and you guys have been simply amazing and it is time for us to you know sign out